Hey, what's up guys? Chip Walters here. Uh, a very quick tutorial on the rotate tool in SketchUp. I learned a couple new ways of rotating today that I did not know of, uh, which I was surprised. Thought I'd share it with you. Uh, maybe it may help uh, some of you as well. So I'm building this, uh, beginning to start to build this workstation. Uh, it's a very elaborate kind of a trader workstation design. And uh, it's got, what, nine monitors on it. And I want to tilt this monitor out. So as you, many of you know, we go to the rotate tool. And as you see, as the Rotate 2 moves around, we have it on the green axis, on the blue axis, can also get on the red axis, or black means it's on, not on any of those axes. So obviously, if I the way it works is you click on an angle and you turn. Well, that's not what we want. So what we want is we want it to, to rotate on this plane right here. So I'm going to hold the Shift key down. Now that I've held the Shift key down, I've locked it to that plane. Now I'm going to click on this little corner right here. Okay. As I click on the corner, I'll go out to here. And then I'll drag it forward. I'll type in 30 and Bob's your uncle. It's done. So that's cool. And that's how I've known how to do it all along. So this one I want to tilt down at 30 degrees. So there's two ways of doing that uh, that I uh, just found out about. One is, that, let's say we go over here on this uh, red, uh, the red plane. And, and just in case, I'll hold the shift key down and I'm going to drag this. And now I'm going to... Uh, Move it around, but you see it's not rotating about the plane uh, about this bottom line here, right? If I try and get it here, you see that I never get to that red. I never get the red because I don't have any thickness on this plane. But if I hold this, okay, with this in the blue corner, and I grab the shift, uh, I, I'm sorry, no, no, I just drag my mouse out perpendicular. Notice that as I drag, it snaps to that plane, and then once that's done, it's a very, very simple matter just to type type in 30. Okay, so that's one way of doing it. Now, another way of doing it that's that's equally as interesting is uh, I can go here, and if I can, remember before we couldn't get it to do it because we're on this plane, but if I get it to snap to, uh, on a corner, the red plane, then all I need to do is hold the shift key down like we did before and drag it up, and again, 30, and Bob's your uncle. So that's, that's really the uh, 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 kind of an interesting way of doing it. Let's go ahead and get this one. This one fixed again. Shift. 30. Okay. So anyway, I hope that helps some of you. I know that for me, uh, there's a couple ways, uh, new ways of rotating that I didn't know about. So uh, usually I'd have to just build out that plane and and, and uh, try and create a face that I could align the uh, rotate tool. But this time I didn't. So I hope that helps. And uh, we'll talk to you next time. Bye.